Hello, everyone, and welcome to MLB The Show 24, No Money Spent. I am so excited for this year. This is my second year doing No Money Spent in MLB The Show, and I am never going back to spending money on this game. Throughout this series, I'm going to be breaking down how I make stubs, how I get all these good players without spending a single dollar on the game, because it's really not that difficult. Um, so I'm really excited for this year. So today we're going to be doing the pre-order pack opening and sort of just giving a breakdown on my plans for the year for No Money Spent. So without further ado, let's get into it. So looking at my packs, when I went through the tutorial, it made me open the starter pack, which was just a gold, and I got Kenley Jansen. Everything else we have here is from the Digital Deluxe pre-order or Twitch drops from watching the stream. So we have 26 show packs. We have a Collector's Edition Batskin, a Cover Athlete Batskin. No one cares about Batskins. Four Twitch drops packs, which are just standard packs, but with a different like, cover. Six gold player items, which are going to be helpful. Ball player equipment. One legend, so these 90 overalls. And then a barrier breaker, so also these 90 overalls. So let's open some packs. So I'm just going to open these bat skins first. Um, but yeah, so this is going to be my second year doing No Money Spent. Those of you who are new to my channel, last year I did No Money Spent. I unlocked Derek Jeter, which was the MLB collection reward within a week of the game releasing i highly doubt that i'm gonna do it again just because there are no sets and seasons and there are like high overalls immediately at the start of the game but i'm looking to do it very fast as i typically do um so let's open this uh, let's open the twitch drops but i'm gonna be going through my strategy today as i open these packs as we get a gold already jose alvarado oh and so i went back to change one of my settings and i get a a free five pack bundle um, let me see if there's, yeah, and then the cornerstone. So I just redeemed my free stuff. So if you don't have these packs, just back out of Diamond Dynasty and then load back in and you should get it. That's how it worked for me. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to be going over my plans for MLB The Show, no money spent this year. So basically the strategy that I used last year is going to be the same strategy that I used this year. So those of you who didn't watch me last year, what I did was when the game first came out, my main goal was to get all of the live series collections done asap that was my number one priority i would be selling off cards that weren't live series and building my team off of of no sell cards that i get from programs um let's go with let's just go with these show packs um, i'm going to be doing that again this year it's going to be a lot harder because you know there aren't like high overalls like there were last year but i'm really excited for it i highly recommend you guys do it too because Getting the live series collections done out of the way first is so nice. We just got a diamond out of a show pack. First diamond pull of the year. Please be Otani. New animation. First time seeing this. Purple. Zach Wheeler. Okay, I like how it's quick. It doesn't take forever. So, I mean, we pulled a diamond. I'll gladly take that. Not going to be too expensive because he is only an 88. Also, if you notice, if I, if I sound sick, I've been sick all week. I'm fine now, thankfully, just in time for it will be the show. But, you know, I've been sick this week. So if my voice sounds a little congested, that's that's why. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to be selling off every single card that I own that I can that isn't live series. And what I did last year was the first players that I would buy for the live series are the 90 pluses. I wouldn't even do collections. I would get all the 90 pluses and then work through all the collections and I'll explain why. So basically in MLB The Show on release, a lot of prices are inflated. The only cards, so all the live series cards are going to go down over time except for the 90 pluses. The 90 pluses always rise after the first week while all the other cards drop. So I try to get all the 90 pluses out of the way first and let the other cards drop in price just to save stops as there's a gold William Contreras okay 16 more show packs to go so already on the board with a diamond pull chase pack okay those of you who watched last year know the strategy every time I get a chase pack I instantly pull it one to six odds of a 90 plus the chase pack reward is John Donaldson would be pretty cool to pull him all right oh but it's not guaranteed a diamond anymore all right can we at least pull diamond? Like, I don't expect Donaldson, but at least a diamond SDS. Thank you. All right, second diamond already. And it's purple, so it is not a 90 plus, so it's not Donaldson. Let's see who it is. Felix Bautista, 87 overall. So already we have two diamond pulls on the board. We love to see it. 
so we've been really lucky with these packs um i don't think i'll ever have more luck than i did last year on opening day i pulled my trout on the first day then will be the show and i wasn't recording it was like some conquest pack it wasn't like my pre-order packs just some conquest pack where i pulled my trout and then i made a video about it I, I will never be more lucky than that unless i pull like a show hey or something but yeah so far two diamonds nearing the end of the show packs before we get into the golds and the pre-order special diamonds uh but i just wanted to say for everyone who was watching last year thank you so much for the support it was the best year of my youtube channel and i'm looking to do even better this year i'm going to be posting similar content but i really want to do a lot more with my no money spent series this year so i'm really excited for that because i feel like i could do a really good job with that too last show pack before we get into the golds and then the exclusive diamonds and we get nobody but two diamonds is definitely I, i'm very happy with that in 26 show packs okay six gold choice packs with these packs i mean everyone's probably already opened them by the time you see this video pick the highest overall don't be dumb just pick the highest overall because it, it's it's the most valuable is there's a glaber torres five okay shane mcclanahan's a gold wow interesting he's the highest overall i'll pick him these are sellable anyway and another glaber i'm still gonna pick him because he has more value three more gold packs and pablo lopez 84 i'll take an 84 those are probably going to be a little expensive and then we have an 81 let's go with chris sale and then do we have one more yeah we do have one more one more gold pack and i'll take the 83 ryan helsley so we have three diamond choice packs here we have the free cornerstone pack which i'm going to go with first and then the barrier breakers and the pre-order one i don't remember the name everybody is going to get this pack um i think i'm gonna go with kodai senga greg maddox he's a control guy but his per nines are just so bad i know his clutch is good but his velo and his per nines are terrible which i don't really like kodai senga at least has better per nines and throws harder and with hitters i'm gonna be getting so many diamond hitters where i, I would rather get pitchers because they're a little harder to get diamond wise earlier in the game so let's go with kodai senga now moving to barrier breakers I already know who I'm picking out of this pack. It is 100% going to be Josh Gibson. Let's take a look at his stats. Very good catching card. Catching diamonds are really, really expensive because they're so rare when the game starts. So I'm going to pick him right away. He's going to be my starting catcher. And let's open this legend pack. I know who I'm picking out of this one. It's Andrew Miller. Having a high overall lefty reliever, just like that with 100s in the per nines and 125 pitching clutch sign me up 100 percent so those were all the packs um i'm not buying any packs do not buy packs and normally spend i will get into that in other videos but let's generate the best lineup can we okay you have to do it through here generate best squad and we're already at an 82 if you look at that we have some goals we have josh gibson uh looking at the rotation we have zach wheeler we also have bautista in the bullpen so not so bad so far so yeah this is going to be it for this video hope you guys enjoyed if you're new here follow me on all my social medias Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, if it doesn't get banned. Uh, but most importantly, make sure to subscribe right here on YouTube. So yeah, very excited for this new year. See you guys in the next one. Peace.